Roxy, we know you're upset about what happened. Did you say upset? I think shocked is more the word. Tell us. Maybe talking about it will make you feel better. <sighs> I could hear all those voices inside my head. All those feelings. Fear, pain, loneliness. I became Nebula, and I couldn't fight it. <laughs> Nobody said being a fairy was going to be easy, Roxy. But you're strong, and you have a special gift. Huh? But I don't want to be special. I'm not like you, Bloom. I live on Earth. My life is here with my father and R2. <laughs> One thing doesn't rule out the other. You'll learn to use your fairy powers without missing out on the normal things in life. I don't know. This is too much for me. I don't think I want it. I understand how you can feel that way. Take your time, Roxy, and think about it. Remember, you can always count on us. Bye. See you soon. Aww. What do you think, R2? <laughs> work, work. All we do is work. Don't we get a vacation? Good morning, girls. Hey! Why the long faces? What happened? We just went to see Roxy. And she doesn't want to be a fairy, right? She's confused and she's shocked by the powers of the White Circle. And I can understand that. <laughs> Let's give her some time. The important thing is to protect her and hope she gains some confidence. But what about the Wizards of the Black Circle? It hasn't exactly been easy battling them. But we can sure hurt them. I remember reading in the Book of Fairies that the more uh -huh. people believe in us, the stronger we'll become. And also, it'll weaken the power of the fairy hunters. With our Believix power, we can convince people that magic exists. <laughs> oh, no! No! <laughs> People to believe in us is easier said than done. I can say something like, Hi, I'm Stella, and I'm a fairy. We could always help people who are in trouble. We could tune in the emergency frequencies with this. That's a great idea, Tecna. Sorry to rain on your parade, girls, but what do we do with this? We better not leave it unguarded. It's an extremely powerful and dangerous object. Roxy lost control when she touched it. Here we go. Problem solved. Now I'll always have it with me, and there won't be any chance of it falling into the wrong hands. Turning your pet into your double to take care of the shop was a great idea, Bloom. <laughs> Well, we canceled today's appointments, but not the pet's food deliveries. And the truck is coming later on. Way to go, Bloom. Sometimes you can be pretty smart, you know? Oh, really? Just sometimes? <laughs> 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 hey, what a surprise. I didn't think I'd see you again so soon, Roxy. Um, I thought that since I have to decide to face my destiny as a fairy, then I think it's a good idea to be around other fairies. And since it's my day off from the Fruity Music Bar, I thought, I'm so sorry for the way I treated you before. I have a bit of a temper. Don't worry about it. Listen, we have to go into town for a mission. Would you like to come with us? Huh? Uh-huh. Perfect. We decided to use our Believix powers to help people on Earth believe in magic. Um, girls, unfortunately I can't come. I have that audition with Jason Queen. We're sorry, Musa. We forgot about it. Don't worry, Musa. You'll be great. Musa, we are all with you. Is Riven taking you there? Yes, I'm meeting him in front of our loft. Bye, girls. I just hope he won't make a scene. What do you mean you don't accept precious stones? Exactly what I said. Either you pay me with real money or you leave your groceries here. Hey, listen. I'm late for an appointment. I really don't have time for this. Go on, go. Don't waste time here. 
Riven, Musa's waiting for you. Listen, you can't let her down today. Riven, go. You'll be late. So, you were saying? Real money only. <laughs> Hey, those two girls are arguing over a dress. That's crazy. Crazy? I wouldn't argue with anyone over that dress. I'll use my Believe It's magic to make them come to an agreement. Great idea, Tecna. I like your enthusiasm. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what did Tecna mean? When we transformed into Believix fairies, we also gained the power to help people. So we really hope that soon people will believe in magic again, just like you did when you believed in us. And that way, we'll become stronger and defeat the Wizards of the Black Circle for good. Yes, but I took it before you seeing doesn't count! Uh. Um, there's no need to argue. Look, we have that dress in green, too. I want it in red! Gem of Mind. <gasps> Be reasonable and thoughtful. Follow your positive vibes. Huh? <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't believe I'm making such a big deal over a dress. Um, listen, you take it. It would look much better on you anyway. Don't worry, seriously, I'll buy another one. I don't even know why I wanted it so much in the first place. Um, girl, sorry, but to tell you the truth, I'm the one who made you see reason. Hmm? Huh? You? I'm sorry, who are you? I'm a fairy. <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> That's funny, a fairy. Wow, huh? this is gonna be harder than I thought. I don't care if you've gotta go see your son's stupid play. Oh. I pay you to work. Now get back to work. What a nasty temper he has. Okay, girls, it's my turn now. Watch closely. Listen to me, I said stay in the office at... Hang on a sec. What? What do you want? Can't you see that I'm on the phone? Yes, and you need to calm down. Relax. Oh. Dawn of light. Huh? Huh? Oh. Find inner peace and serenity. Wow. I feel wonderfully good. Hello? Yes, of course you can go to your son's play. As a matter of fact, why don't you take the whole day off? A simple thank you will do. I beg your pardon? It's because of me that you're in a good mood now. You see, I'm a fairy. <gasps> um, yeah, listen, I'd love to stay and chat with you, but I I've really got to go. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> it's your fault if we're late. If you didn't want to come with me, then you should have just stayed home. I already told you it couldn't be helped. Forget about it. I just hope Jason isn't mad at me. Ah, uh, Jason, is it? So you're already on a first name basis with this guy? Oh, wow, look how beautiful it is. Are you kidding me? Don't tell me you like this. You, sir, you finally made it. I was getting worried about you. <sighs> Jason, I'm sorry, but I ran into, um, a snag. Well, listen, the important thing is that you're here now. Huh? Huh? Yes, and I'm here too. My name's Riven. And I'm her boyfriend. Nice to meet you, Riven. I'm glad you're here too. Now, if you just follow me. You're being ridiculous and obnoxious. And you're flirting with him. Oh, Jason, I'm so sorry. Hmm? Uh -huh. mm. Girls, I don't know about you, but this is killing me. I didn't think it would be this difficult to persuade people to believe in our existence. Maybe we're doing something wrong. Tecna, you said you could pick up emergency signals, right? Maybe we're not solving the right problems. We need to help in emergencies. It's not the situations that are wrong. I think you should change the way you approach them. What do you mean? You're powerful fairies, but it works a lot differently for human beings. You have to be so careful with them. You have to feel them out, make a connection with their hearts. It's the only way you're going to make believers out of them. I don't know how to explain it properly, but it's like what happens between me, R2, and other animals. There's a soulful connection. I think you're right, Roxy. Thank you, you've helped us so much. Oh, I tuned into the fire department frequency. There's a fire in a building two blocks from here. Huh? Well, 
Oh, what are we waiting for? Winx, believe it! to teleport. I'll take Roxy with me. magic to rescue her. Oh, honey, you were so brave. Yeah. Mommy, it was magic. Suddenly everything became beautiful and the fire was gone. Those girls are fairies. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but they are special. That's for sure. Something's wrong. This isn't a normal fire. Look over there. <gasps> I'll try to strengthen the ceiling. Plasma wall. <laughs> Ogron! I should have known it was you! Did you like my trap? You can't imagine how much I enjoy setting fire to this building. <laughs> you risked the lives of all those people! We'll go to any length to get the white circle. Now give it to us or prepare to meet your doom! Don't! Ogron absorbs all the energy from our attacks, remember? This time, you're not going to defeat us that easily, Ogron. <laughs> I'm here, Ogron. Good, I see you enjoy playing. Super Prism! Holy cow, how come we have to fight Gamblos? Must be our lucky day. Uh, stop this one. Okay, I've had enough with the clapping. Sun Jam. <laughs> Autumn wind. Ah. Oh, somebody. 
Everybody's in danger! Where do you think you're going? Help me! <laughs> That's enough! Supernova! Huh? What? They disappeared! Yes, unfortunately they're gone. Well, at least the fire's out. Look, the wizards took the magic planes with them when they vanished. Help me! Let's go, quickly! <sighs> Oh. Dad! Use the power! It's you! Yes, Dad? You've become a really good fairy. Musa, you were amazing. That song came right from your heart. And what a voice. Oh, uh, thanks, Jason. No, thank you. Now tell me, are you ready to become a star? It's so nice to see you again. Did you see the explosion? Where's the family that was rescued? Can I have a statement? Girls, my moment has arrived. Actually, we were just leaving. But... Uh, uh, she's right, Dad. I'm fine, Bloom. Don't worry. Go on. <laughs> Did you see that, Mommy? They are fairies. Yes. You're right. What was the cause of the fire? And who were those girls? Um, do you believe in magic and in fairies? We do! Huh? Yes! I did it! It's a miracle, because you could have sung a lot better. Do you... you really think so? Well, Jason liked me, and he's the music expert. Of course, just like I suppose I'm an expert on cooking or knitting. Why are you acting like this? Aren't you happy for me? You were obnoxious during the whole audition. I almost regret- What do you regret? Nothing. No, come on, say it. What do you regret, huh? Asking me to come with you, right? Yes, that's right. You've done nothing but criticize me all day. Is this your way of supporting me? Oh, don't worry. I'm leaving. Ask your friend Jason to support you. <sighs> it's okay, Musa. He's just jealous. You all right? But what did I do to him? You didn't do anything. It's your talent that bothers him. But how is that possible? He's my boyfriend. He should be happy for me. Envy spares no one. That is the first lesson you'll have to learn when you become a star. Now don't you worry anymore. I believe in you, Musa. With Jason, I feel so protected. He's so good to me. Not like Riven. Riven. Girls, I'm so exhausted. I just want to dive into a hot bath. <laughs> huh? That's... that's you! Kiko? What happened? I'd say a coup. Bloom, next time you want to turn our pets into our doubles, let me know. I'll do it with holograms. <laughs> you know what, girls? I'm really glad I came with you today. Seeing you in action was very educational. It was educational for us too, Roxy. We couldn't have done it without you. Yep, it was enlightening. Yes, without you, we would have never known how to reach people's hearts. They certainly are different from the beings on magics. Simpler in many aspects. But also more complicated. Now, nobody stop me. I've got a date with a bath full of bubbles. Hmm? Musa! <laughs> oh no, don't tell me the audition went badly. No. No, the audition went really well. It's... it's Riven. Riven? 
What's Riven got to do with it? What happened, Musa? Riven ruined the most wonderful day of my life. I needed him, and instead he just criticized me. He was so obnoxious. But you know what Riven's like, don't you? I'm sure that everything will be fine tomorrow. No, Stella. Tomorrow everything won't be fine. Because this time, I've changed. I made up my mind. It's over between Riven and I. I can't wait to activate the Emperor's throne! And you will! As soon as we get the other seals. And when we do, we'll rule! <laughs> you know what, Icy? You already rule. Oh, Titanus. <laughs> oh, this is getting ridiculous. Ugh, tell me when it's over! A la 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 To the Pillar of Balance! <laughs> and the second seal! Ha! Tritanus is leaving. I can warn Bloom. Soon. Soon. My fellow sovereigns, Tritanus has already taken the seal from the Pillar of Light. Will we allow him to attack the other pillars of the infinite ocean? And how do we know he will do that? Do you propose that we wait to find out? We must protect the pillars of balance and control. Yes! I must protect my kingdom. <sighs> we will not stand for this, Levi. We must be stopped. Father, Arachleon must defend the pillars. No, Arachleon must defend itself. And as Crown Prince, I would expect you would know that, my son. But the best defense of our planet is to join the fight with the other realms. We are stronger no, together. No, no. For us, Arachlean must always come first. That is our duty. How can you say that? Princess Bloom, this is between me and my son. I did not ask for your opinion. But a king can be wrong. And Sky, I believe you think he is. Bloom. If you will excuse us. But Sky, I think your audience with the Crown Prince is over, Bloom. <laughs> hey, huh? you were humming. Oh, sorry. I guess I got a little carried away by the music. <laughs> That's okay. Actually, it's great. That was my mother's favorite song. She used to sing it to me when I was little. Uh, hey, uh, what's that wonderful sound underneath the tune in that song? That's the sound of the singing whales of melody. The whale singing keeps the whole planet in balance.
The whale song reminds me of my mother and how happy we were at home on Melody. You really miss her, don't you? Always, but especially today, because... Uh... Oh, man. I'm really sorry, Musa, but... Uh... I've got to go. What? Y yeah, I, um... I'll talk to you later. Riven! Oh, man. What was that about? Weird. Where did he run off to? You know, sometimes I just don't understand him at all. I think we're getting along great, and then... <gasps> what? Musa, what's the matter? <gasps> I'm sure there's a good explanation. Well, well, I'd like to hear it. Huh? What's Kiko up to? <laughs> I guess I'm not the only one who's unlucky in love. Oh, Musa. I'll be okay, because today is a very special day. You know, it's the Singing Whales Day. Today, the Singing Whales of Melody reveal themselves. Hello, Musa. Hi, Dad. How are you? Are you at the Song Wharf? Well, of course I am, darling. You know that there is no way that I would ever miss seeing the singing whales and hearing their song. Ooh, show me! They're so beautiful! Sky wouldn't even listen to me! Sky loves you, Bloom. He, he told me to go away! Well, rude, but come on, you totally know that he still totally loves you. But he didn't show it. Bloom, Bloom! Daphne? Tritanus is on his way to the Pillar of Balance to take the seal! Daphne! You must hurry, Bloom. The Pillar of Balance! Stop him! <gasps> Tritanus is on the move. The Pillar of Balance! Let's shake things up! Stop! No! You may not approach the Pillar of Balance! That's what you think, you shrimps. Selkies! Battle formation! <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> Isn't he wonderful? Oh, yeah. Totally. Ha ha ha!
domination of the magic dimension! You and me! We rule! <laughs> <laughs> you and me! <laughs> they don't even know we're here. Plus, they don't even care. And when Tritanus is Emperor and Icy is Empress, what are we gonna be? Their personal assistants. I don't think so. Let's show them they need us. Do some evil on our own? Yep. Starting now. But uh, don't worry. They'll never even know we're gone. Come on! Tannis has hit us again. Huh? Ah! Father, what should we do? Listen, Sky. We must return to Arachleon immediately. Our kingdom is in danger. Go home! Secure your realms! Protect your citizens! <laughs>
Let's ambush, ambush them. them. Ambush? I like it. Yeah! You guys take on Icy. Check. We'll handle Tritanus. And take back the seal. Wait until you have a clear shot at them and act together. Now everybody, hide! Over here, you guys! <laughs> hurry, hurry! Right behind you! In here! The second seal. Let's collect all three. <laughs> <laughs> Where are Darcy and Stormy? I don't know. Maybe they're just late. Something's not right. <sighs> I'm so looking forward to having power over, like, everything. What could be better? Hmm. Let me think about it. Nothing! <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Ready! Let's do this! Go get them, Lynx! <laughs> <gasps> the Winx! What? Blinding Ray! Spreading fire! Nyad's attack! <laughs> Digital Strike! Lotus Flower! Tritanus! Ha! You two don't scare me! Ha!
fairy is just so fine. Luckily, now it's mine. <laughs> it didn't work. Come on. There is no way Rumpelstiltskin can stand up to our convergence power. Right. Everyone? Mythic Convergence! Silly, silly fairies. Why can't you see? <laughs> Try as you might, you will never beat me. <laughs> Our magic doesn't work at all. We can't give up. You're right. We haven't lost yet to one of the tricks monsters. We are not about to start now. The tricks and I do not work as one. I'm in it alone and make my own fun. In that case, maybe we could reason with him. Now you're drumming to the beat in my head. Let's strike a deal and put this thing to bed. Bloom, I don't think this is a good idea. How do we know he's not just going to trick us again? We need Musa's voice back. She's our friend. We have to help her. What other choice do we have? Not to mention, we need the power of her voice to protect Althea. <laughs> you poor little girls. Just trying to help a friend. Don't you worry, I'll give you what you need. And that will be the end. For real? <laughs> oh, I love getting what I want. But then again, this voice is quite valuable, I'd say. I will need something from you before I give it away. But you stole her! If that is the way to save Musa, then I say that is what we will do. Righto, follow me. I need something special, something magic, something rare. Like the ones in my collection that you see over there. I know what we can give him, but if we do, what are our chances? Oh, I'm sure you have something you are willing to give away. Something you could get me within the next day. We don't have anything as rare as these relics. Well, except for the legendarium key. Stella! <gasps> yes, yes, yes! Your idea is perfect, I must say! The legendarium key is what you must hand my way. What? <laughs> hmm? Well, perhaps it is too special to give it to little old me. And I hope you don't disagree. But if that is the case, I will accept nothing but the key. Ugh, so demanding. It comes with the territory. Now what do we do? <gasps> Eldora? Girls, listen up. Uh, Eldora, we're over here. <laughs> right. <clears throat> Consider what is most important to you and do what you know is right. Do you have a decision to set this straight? I've given up on trying to wait. I'm sorry, we need more time to think about it. But time is so precious to me and to you. The hours to count down are but a few. If this is going to be a fair transaction, we need a more quantifiable time to deliberate. Right, fine, whatever she just said. Ugh. But wait too long and I will keep the voice instead. Now don't lose your dally. Everything is going to be okay, Musa. She's right, not to worry. The wings will find a solution. to get Musa's voice back. Without her magical music, there's no way Althea can stand up to the tricks and Cloud Tower. But we need the Legendarium Key to lock Selena's evil book for good. 
That's a valid point as well. I know for sure that Mirsa wouldn't want to put the entire magic dimension in danger. Maybe you guys haven't realized, but we don't even know where Cloud Tower is. We have no way of getting into the Legendarium, so that key is pretty much useless. It's not an easy decision. For now, let's go find Musa and cheer her up. Maybe we can get a sense of where she stands in all of this. Like I said, any challenge you pick, winner becomes leader of the specialists. Riven, it's really not like you to be so... so serious. People change, Sky. Fine. Fencing. <laughs> 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 Force is no good with light weapons like these. Try finesse. I don't need your help. I can see that. Touche! You got me, I give up. You will always be leader of the specialists, and I will always be runner-up. Give yourself some credit. It was an even match. If you kept your cool, you probably would have won. It's not just this match, Sky. No matter how hard I try, or how close I get, I always come up short. If I don't change something, I'll never reach the top. Ugh, you are useless. And that book is useless. All it's done is given us some annoying little man who lives in a forest filled with toys. Not to mention that he won't follow my orders. Nobody disobeys the tricks! Musa lost her voice, right? Just like you asked. Althea's defenseless without her music. For now. So, we have to attack now and wreck those silly instruments while we still have the chance! Don't worry, sisters. I've got an idea. Witches, I hope 
hope you are ready for today's lesson. You bet. Can't wait. Who can tell us the most important quality in a young witch? Independence. Ambition. Power. Correct. With power comes great responsibility. Everyone step forward. A brand new power awaits you. Ready, sisters? <laughs> I'm dying to see if this works. For their sake, I hope it does. Get ready, girls. Thundershot! Icicle needles! Dark ray! <gasps> this intangibility spell is gonna rock. Finally, something that won't run away from the wings. These witches cannot be hurt by any direct attack. It's the perfect next move. Hi. Oh, oh, hey, Daphne. Cool concert, huh? Yeah. I've always loved live music. It's a great venue for, you know, people getting together. Totally. Well, it's also, um, maybe a great place for a date? <laughs> of course. At a concert, yeah. Daphne, would you be my date to this concert? <laughs> I thought you'd never ask. <sighs> okay, so I think, I think I think I have everything I need. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Think so. Oh. <laughs> How about now? Even better. It's almost time. Attention, everyone. Musa would like to welcome you all to the first concert of the Music Cafe Band. Now, let's hear it for the Winks! You guys are great! Yeah, Musa! The Winks! Yeah. Oh, Aisha! <laughs> Joining them on stage for a special guest performance, Roxy and the student musicians! Yeah. Yeah. And now for the Althea anthem. Musa, the stage is yours. a point to this attack? Right! Destroy those instruments! Now's our chance! <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? None of our attacks are working! What about Musa? Don't let them near the stage! 
Althea, I just wish I could be half as remarkable as you. I wasn't able to save your voice, and I couldn't be there for you once it was gone. You deserve better. All clear. The safe looks, well, safe. Eldora certainly knows good craftsmanship. So, back to the show we go. Am I interrupting? What are you doing here? I'm afraid you've reached the end of the line. Give me the key, or the voice is mine. <laughs> Great news! The new Althea anthem is climbing the charts. There's already a remix. Now, as for your dilemma here, girls, remember what's most important to you. Listen to this lady who seems so smart. What is the answer deep in your heart? Musa risked everything to fight with us, even without her voice. Because she's our friend. And that's what friends do. Help each other in times of need. <laughs> well, there you have it. My job here is done. I will give you the voice, and then toodaloo, I must run. Yusa, there's something I've been meaning to get off my chest. I'm supposed to be there for you every day, to support you and protect you as a specialist and as your boyfriend. But right now, I'm just not capable of doing either one of those things. Yusa, your voice, it's back. I guess it is. I can't believe it. Riven, we've certainly had our ups and downs, and it is clear now that we're not meant to be together. But you will always be a hero to me. I guess I just have to figure out a way to be a hero to myself, if that makes sense. You always got me, Musa. Deep down, I know that this is the right thing for both of us. For now, let's be friends. You got your voice back! It worked! Come on, Yusa, everyone's waiting for you. We've got celebrating to do. Riven, you coming? Sorry, guys, not this time. Riven, 
Where are you going? I've got some work to do, and I've got to do it on my own. Wait, did I miss something? You're leaving? Like, for good? <sighs> good luck, Riven. We're here for you. And we always will be. I'll see you guys. Goodbye, Musa. Mm-hmm. <laughs>